Hey, what's going on everyone? Today's the 18th of February, 2023. Man, let's talk about GameStop today. I'm gonna to show you all from the chart perspective that it's telling us that the, that the market in, in GameStop is gonna go higher, that it's a buy, all right? So let's just break this down real quick. We're gonna look from the chart and then there's an article written from the street talking about how Ray Dalio or of Bridgewater has came through and actually bought more GameStop and AMC positions. Now, when you have somebody of, of a magnitude as Ray Dalio or Bridgewater, this massive hedge fund, and you get these articles saying that they triple their position in GameStop, then obviously you need to perk up and say, okay, cool. If, if smart money is moving into GameStop, if they're tripling their position in GameStop, then obviously they know something is up. That's one thing. The second thing though, that I pay attention to is not necessarily what I see in articles because if it doesn't correlate with the price chart, then I already know this article is fluff and that is not real. And that is just simply gossip and a rumor. Now, if what they're saying gels with the price chart, then they have some validity to what they wrote. It's just that simple. So right now you guys can see on my last video in GameStop, I didn't do a price prediction. I wanted us to see how low price was going to go. And it was on February the 2nd, 2000, I mean, February the 7th, 2023 so here we are today and over the last couple of days since february the 7th was the market was right here in gamestop this is where price was give me just a second get this arrow up this is where the price was in, in gamestop price did dip and this is where the buyers came into the market for gamestop so that's the first thing we're going to do is identify where the market support came in boom right there Charts don't lie. Just like the buyers came in at, on January 19, 2023, the buyers came in again these three days from the 10th, the 13th, and then on the 14th. This is where the buyers showed up. So guess what? As long as GameStop price trades above $19, we're going to expect the market to go higher. Just that simple. Don't let people come in and try to make this game difficult because you will end up pulling out all of your hair you will end up throwing your laptop, your computer monitor because you're in frustration because you can't figure this game out. And already the market is giving you answers to your questions. So I already know as long as price and GameStop holds $19, the probability is on the buyers that price is going to continue to trend up. I already know that. So you guys can probably tell in the tone of my voice that I'm not concerned. I'm not nervous. I already know how I would play this particular market in GameStop. So we got that established. The next thing that we need to figure out is, okay, how high do we suspect the market's gonna go in GameStop? Zooming out this price chart, let's take a look at this on the wiki chart first. And we need to, I, we need to take this horizontal line here. And this is a massive area of resistance now in the GameStop, right there around $23.83, maybe around like 24, just to say $24. Is where the problem could be for the buyers. We've already seen on the prior week that GameStop got rejected two weeks in a row. Take a look at that. The week of January the 30th, 2023, and then the week of February the 6th, 2023. That's a problem for the buyers. That's going to be one of our price targets. That's the first area right there. Now, one thing that I do like, though, looking at this on a weekly chart is right here on this week, price was massively weak. It went down, right? It closed down here on the low end of the price bar and volume also came through. When you see this type of weekly price bar, it, automatically you need to think that price is going to go lower. And when you don't see that happen on the following week, price comes up instead. It still tells you that the market buyers are there it still tells you that price is geared to continue to go higher. Pretty much like what happened here, like history is already being repeated on price charts. You just got to find out what you're looking at. Look at this one. The week of January the 3rd, 2023, price went down, right? So naturally the idea following all of these other weeks price and gain side was dipping was for it to continue to go lower, correct? Yes, but look what happened. Price went up instead. Okay, the following week, price went down, right? But then take a look at the next week, price went up. 
this is where the market is buying this is where ray dalio presumably is coming in and buying gamestop this is where he tripled his position simple so that's my first target right there around 24. my second one is going to be here around 2750 and then let's just run up to around 30 dollars as the third target okay so let's see what we're working with first target is around 24 okay so that's around 8.14 percent market move higher 24 dollars the second one so i bring it up it's going to be around 27.50 that's 24 percent move higher 27.44 and then that third one like i said is around 30 i'll bring it down just a tad to like 29.50 that is 33.44 percent market move higher 29.50 simple that's it i'm done not hard it's not complicated don't let people try to come and make this thing confusing all right so let me put this back on the daily so we can keep track of the price action and GameStop on the daily time frame okay and we already know that we're going to continue to expect price to go higher as long as it holds i got 19 but i'll hold around 18 as well too I'm going to hold this horizontal line here because I really want us to see how weak price can go, where the sellers can be at into the market at GameStop. So I'm going to hold this horizontal line for, at around $24, just as a reference. And I am done. Everyone, give me your thoughts about GameStop. Where do you think price is going to go for one? And then two, if you think it's going to go up, if the direction is up, give me your targets. If you think price is going to go down, give me your targets. This is just a game of probabilities. Let's not make it more complicated. Let's not make it more than what it ought to be. This is just simply a game of probabilities. And from the charts, it looked like the buyers are trying to move this market up. That's what I'm seeing. Now, you all may see something totally different, which is cool. There's nothing wrong with that. Whatever system you guys have, whatever strategy you have, it needs to produce an edge. Okay. And as you guys can tell from my videos that I produce on this channel, I got that edge. We're able to forecast where prices are going to go. That is the edge that we possess. That nobody can actually hinder or impact. AI, algorithms, hedge funds. No one has the ability to get ahead of an edge to where you are predicting prices. Let's figure out which one is right. Make sure you maintain the profitability. And as always, trade different.